fight right there. That was awesome. Two weeks later. Goodness, I went to level 50. My, what a smashing ensemble. Smash it ensemble, Geralt. Shut up. I look like a twit. <laughs> sewn of the best fabrics available and according to the best tailoring practices. But one must have a modicum of taste to appreciate this. Even the most exquisite robes cover only deficiencies in beauty, never in refinement. Mm. Rather not bicker about taste. Don't like to. It's neither interesting nor productive. This particular witcher has an inborn intolerance for formal occasions. Yet he's to attend just such an event shortly. I expect that's the source of his prickliness. So try not to take things personally, Master Taylor. Rather pity him. For in truth, stage fright overwhelms him. He trembles at the thought that he has no notion how to behave in the presence of Her Grace's Majesty. Hmm. As well he should. All that being as it may, Toussaint's highest honor, the Order of <coughs> Vitus Vinifera, demands appropriate attire. I'm getting an the award, Duchess am I? cannot be expected to drape the medal on a suit of armor caked in mud. Palace protocol places enormous emphasis on form, virtuous tradition, etiquette. Huh. A tradition which values appearances ahead of all else. Which calls for lordly, glistening triviality and misplaced generosity. Hmm. Hmm. Ceremonies, medals honoring virtues, just keeps coming up. I've had no reprieve either, and I keep thinking of the last great virtue, compassion. It's the one piece of the puzzle that never seemed to fit. Mean you suddenly believe the five virtues theory, after all we've revealed? It's not a question of belief, superstition, or old wives' tales. It's a conclusion derived through exercising pure logic. Siana planned everything in advance. Had we not stopped her, surely there'd have been a fifth victim. One the gossips would have associated with a lack of compassion. Her plans don't matter now. Can't act on them. Ask the messenger who delivered my invitation to the ceremony. Siana's in the palace. Courtiers pressured the Duchess to lock her in a tower. Do you care not a whit who else was in her black book? We've some time before the ceremony. We could still chat with that boot-cleaning urchin. He was the one to pass the victim's names to Detlaf. Perhaps we missed something. Hmm. Let's do it. All in all, why not check up on that? We'll go together. Assuming we're done here. I am done, yes. It lies in your hands now to see if you are able to present my handiwork at the ceremony. Well, hopefully it doesn't get dirty. It is due. Or if you will first destroy it, crawling about the city's underbelly. Promise to be careful. Yeah, we'll see about that. Hopefully the boot black can help us. This little... Oh, it's the swordsman. This Good little kid see. here. Here for a spiffing? Dirty boots are a stain on professional dignity, you know. Step on up. Need to ask you something. Yet again? Go on then. I'm a proponent of free speech and I will gladly tell you all I know. But why not get your boots shanked while we jabber? Guess they could use a spit and polish. Then I shall take advantage as well. A friend of mine used to say boots should be as clean as the souls that wear them. Oh my, clean Geralt. Boots, clean souls. A fine slogan. Bum, 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 bum. Man in the frock coat. You passed him some letters, remember? Why, of course. I'm young, got a mind like a steel trap, but... If you're about to tell me this information will cost me, forget it. How'd you get those letters? Beggars brought them. Beggars. Tell us more about them. How many were there? Why, four. One for each letter. Just four? Sure you didn't get a fifth? I can't count, you know. Remember anything else? 
These beggars have anything in common? What? Come now, it was different. Some had mismatched boots, others had no boots at all. Oh, I know! They all had no home! Oh, that's helpful. My patience is starting to run a little thin. Now think hard. Where'd they get the letters? They picked them up? Get them from someone? I don't know. They'd come, hand me a letter, and walk away. I asked no questions. Geralt, allow me to ask a question. Listen, lad. I'll be glad to mix another batch of that bootshine for you. But you must focus now and tell us all you know. Where can we find the beggars? Well, at the shelter, most like. Where's that? Everyone knows. It's just round the corner. Up those stairs, then right. Thanks, kid. For your trouble. We must visit okay. Shelter. Look around inside. This is very interesting. We're finding out and trying to figure out who that fifth person was. People see. What's going on here? What do you want? To talk. Here, that's a waste of breath. We've tried it only to tire our lips. We'll use other means of persuasion now. I kind of like Regis. I wish he could come back to Velen. Either get out along with these flea ridden vagabonds, or we'll toss you all out. Our patience is gone. This place is no longer a rank refuse dump. Scram! Decent folk live here. Oops. Decent folk you mention. Mean yourselves. Why? Do you doubt it? Hell yes. Hear that, Atua? Oh no. He poking insults us. On our own. Uh oh. Geralt's gonna get this thing messed up. We should step aside, good fellow. My friend is perfectly capable of settling this unfortunate dispute on his own. Carol's going to get his jerkin dirty. Now. Okay. My goodness, Geralt, you are not having a very good time here. Okay. There we go. That worked out just fine. All right. I can take a hint. Come, time to go. I thank you so much for your aid. I tried to reason with them, but they'd have beat me blue had you not come along. I'm grateful. Immensely. What did they want from you? They are neighbors. Wish me to take my folk, the shelter, elsewhere. They dislike that I help the beggars. I do not oppose going elsewhere were we to have somewhere to go. But you've come with a problem, have you? My turn to aid you. Need some information. Looking for a man who might have mentioned the boot black in Rue de Girl. The boot black? A feisty He is quite feisty. Any of your, uh, wards supposed to meet him recently or soon? Forgive me. Those I help and I are not so close that I would know. But should you wait, they'll all soon come for their meal. You can question them yourselves. Thanks. We'll wait. Nice of you to let us. Now we wait. Hopefully we don't miss the ceremony. <laughs> the ceremony! It will be soon, Geralt. Now we have to see My who dear, these dudes are. I have a matter to address before I serve this soup. These two gentlemen have some questions of you. Pay attention. Answer in brief. For if you draw it out, your soup will go cold. And we wouldn't want that, would we? Recently, four of you delivered sealed letters to the boot black. I know this. Does anyone know what the gentleman means? Go on, speak up. Romain? Why should I squeal? We were all told not to mention the letters. We all swore. You can tell me, Romain. You were given a letter and you delivered it, right? Good work, Romain. Thank you. Who else? 
I got one too. Uh, gave it to the boot black. And Freshy, he got one. But he can't tell you, as he's not here. What's going on Mr. here? Half mine. I'm to deliver it two days after the feast of Saint Barnabas. It's a matter of importance to the duchy. Hand it over, or I'll take it from you, plain and simple. Oh, ho, 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 ho. But I was to deliver it personally. Let no one else see it. That is what she said, and she was frightening. You ought to heed folk who are kind and honest. These men helped me a short while ago, helped all of us. If this individual threatened you, you need not keep the promise you made. All right, take it. I didn't want to see the boot black anyways. It's always muddy there. Oh man, we get to see who the fifth person was. Who is that? Damn it. What is it? Another name, truly? See for yourself. Is it what's his name? Uh, I, I can't think of his name. Well, well. I... I must say, even I did not expect this. This time you will see to our Duquesa. It seems we underestimated Siana rather grossly. Wait a second. Judging by this, Detloff was literally supposed to tear her heart out. Oh my Yet goodness. First, must snap her neck. Puzzling. Duchess was to be Detloff's last victim. Sienna planned it from the start. Indeed. The logical conclusion, Geralt. Four seemingly random victims to start. The virtue's their only link. Enough to get folk talking about a righteous, vengeful beast. Obscured the victim's links to Sienna. Even as she had those she despised killed off one by one, leaving the Duchess for last. Had she managed to fulfill her plan, none would have questioned the reasons. Most would have thought Anna Henrietta had died for her sins. She was known My to goodness, show her what a plan. occasions. Ample proof of a lack of compassion. Why would Sienna murder her own sister? Out of envy? To take power? From an inborn pension for evil? Yes. Yes and yes. All seem likely, and none are mutually exclusive. But if you'd like to know for certain, you can always ask her yourself. Yeah, I want to check it. I want to see. To learn her motives. Praiseworthy, I suppose. Very interesting. Sometimes one should stare evil in the face. Seems a bit strong, no? She used my friend as her tool for killing. I believe I've every right to condemn her. But I support your lust for the truth. Yes, lust. Some philosophers Whoops. think empirical examination the sole path to knowledge. I believe you mentioned the Duchess keeps Siana locked up. Courtiers were insisting on a harsher punishment. Much harsher. Think Anna Henrietta had to protect her sister from a lynch mob as much as she wanted to protect her subjects from a criminal. One way or another, she's locked away in a secluded wing of the palace, awaiting trial before a court of law. I'd need to get past some guards to see her. Coming with? Of course not. I shall await you at Mayor Leche's long. I'll not risk entering the palace after Detlaf and his minions rampage. Besides, I vastly prefer the company of a simple mug of mandrake brew to that of the Duchess's vile sister. Oh. So, said straight up, it means you're going off to get drunk because you hate Siana. I've never been fond of categorical statements of that kind. But I admit I could not vouch for my behavior in her presence. She treated Detlaf cruelly. Cause his death in the end, and now this, atop all that, no, Geralt. I will not go with you. I will await you at the cemetery. Oh boy, oh boy. Finding out some motives here. Finding out some motives here. This is quite the... The events unfolding, if it were, as it were. Wait a second, where's the closest fast travel? I don't want to run all the way. I guess there's one coming up here. Oh, I guess there's one coming up here. Oh, I can take that one up to the palace. What are you doing out here, strumpet? Hello, strumpet. Hello, dog. Okay. 
Up to Buclair Palace. Let's go to. Oh, goodness. It's almost daytime now. Damien de la Tour. Where could I go? To try and get over there. To talk to. What's your name? Hello? I'm assuming this is it. Like, this is pretty lax for. Oh, goodness. Halt! Need to see Siana urgently. In the matter of. Want to talk to her? It's important. Want to talk? Go see your gran at tea time. Not one locked up on the Duquesa's orders. No doing without special permission. Period. Found some information Ard. important to her case. I mean, actually. Explanation urgently. Ah, fine then. You're that witcher who solved the murders, no? Then you for my permission, but only for a few minutes. Promise to be brief. Okay, cool, cool. Get a chance to talk to her. The witcher will speak with the inmate. You can take a momentary break. As long as it's truly but a moment. Highly irregular, this. Oh, she's sitting over there. Man, this isn't very crazy guarded. Have you come to see how I fare. I'm fine, thank you. Artorius's Ripon worked wonders. It's a shame they took it from me. I for... know who the fifth victim was supposed to be. Goodness, you're simply a compulsive snoop. I'm in prison. Deadlaf is dead. Did you not just drop it? Sienna, stop pretending you couldn't care less. I know it's an act, and it's really starting to wear. Why do you want to kill her? For such an accomplished investigator to ask about the obvious? Come now, Geralt. Why do you think? Because she turned her back on you, then banished all memory of you. Bravo, Geralt. Yet another riddle solved, and your sick curiosity sated. That's a cool well, shot. What now? Off to share your discovery with Anna Henrietta. Though she's no longer in danger, true. But she very well might add a little something to your reward. Definitely gonna tell her. Not necessarily for the coin, though. Then why do it at all? She ought to know. If only because you'll probably try to kill her again if she ever lets you out. I probably will. Oh! At least you're being honest, finally. Lying only ever makes sense when there's a chance someone will believe you. It's actually refreshing, in a way, to say what I truly think. So why don't I do it a bit more? I was only ever nice to you to get you to sleep with me. <laughs> I thought you might come in handy one day. Your comrade Regis is using you, and Anna Henrietta perceives you solely as her unthinking, blunt instrument. She's right to, you know. I like this game. As long as we're being honest, here I go. You're a pathetic, self-centered snake. Should I go on? You'll rot in this tower. You'll die of old age, embittered, alone and forgotten. By everyone. Have a nice life, Siana. <laughs> oh, she's gonna... <laughs> Gonna hit the window there. She held her hand though. She stayed her hand. Ah, the Palace of Beclair. Okay, well, that was enlightening. Commander de la Tour would like to see you. Shall we go at once? Yes, let's go. Let's go. Wanna see him too. Let us go talk to Delator. Look at all these roses. Damien. Geralt, it's about time. Ready for the ceremony. Oh man, he's scarred up bad. Got some important information. 
Anna Henrietta was supposed to be Detloff and Siana's fifth victim. You are certain of this? Completely. Found proof. Inconceivable. How could she? The murders, the mayhem she brought down on the city, were they not enough? She sought to strike down her own sister, her liege, traitor. I must alert my men. Enlarge the Duchess's honor guard. Make certain Sylvia Anna is closely watched during the questioning. I'll see to it personally. I thank you, Witcher, for alerting me, and I appreciate your attentiveness. Of course. Let's begin the ceremony. Come with me. The Duchess awaits. It's better be a good ceremony. Ceremony! In the guild's name, I beg your assistance, your enlightened highness. Without barrels, production will come to a stop and it will be the end of us. You lost them all in the fire. These are horrible tidings. Oh, we are most dreadfully saddened. Yes, your enlightened highness all. Once the beasts had clawed their way into the warehouse, the whole place went up in flames. I shall dispatch a palace guardsman to examine the site of the blaze. If things are as you say, fitting compensation shall be paid from the ducal treasury. Thank you, your enlightened highness. Your grace, Geralt of Rivia has arrived. My dear subjects, we come now to our next point of business. Of all the duties which fall upon my shoulders, as the ruler of this dominion, this duty is dearest to my heart. For now, we shall award the Order of Vitis Vinifera, Tucson's Ooh highest honor. Geralt of Rivia, slayer of the beast of Beauclair, step forth. <clears throat> we bestow the distinction there, girl. upon the Witcher, who saved Beauclair from the terrible beast. Such oh, that's a nice desire. pin. May this symbol serve as a reminder to all that the Witcher shall forever remain a friend of Beauclair. In more familiar terms now, I thank you immensely, Geralt. Damien has your reward for you. After all, it was but a contract. Thank you. I have a small surprise for you. In a How much money? Five thousand! A dozen barrels of Son Real. <gasps> a wine normally reserved for the ducal table. Oh my good granny. The gustatory experience of a lifetime awaits. Are you content? <laughs> okay, truly honored. Feels like a second distinction. I'm honored. Thank you. I trust you shall make good use of it. Well, anything else? In a moment I shall speak to Siana. Will you assist me? You returned my sister to me. Yet you also showed me her horrendous deeds. As head of state, I must judge her fairly. But she is my sister. Thus my heart bleeds for her. If Can I tell her now? will help in any manner, of course I'll stay. We shall now question a person implicated in the murders which recently ravaged our fair city of Beauclair. Captain De La Tour, show Sylvia Anna in. In? Why is it showing this angel thing? It's showing statues, this is scary. The Witcher will take part in our talk. 
The Duchess requested I be present. You have committed crimes. Grave crimes. Yet you are my sister. And my heart does not allow me to treat you as a common criminal. Thus I have asked Geralt to advise me. As one impartial. I shall now hear what he has to say. Oh boy, wait a second. Hmm. Your Grace, as head of state, you should look first and foremost after your dominion. Siana's actions, what drove them, be damned. She's a threat to your subjects. You are correct. They are what matters. I must not forget this. Siana, you shall be tried and given a fitting punishment. Yet we shall never cease to be family. As Duchess, I shall have to judge you. But as your sister, I shall never stop loving you. Will you forgive me? Uh-oh. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Hopefully there's not a knife around. I shall never forget. <gasps> no! Oh crap. Oh. Oh! Oh my good granny. No! Stupid Siana. Curse of the Black Moon. Oh. You've got to be kidding me right now. Unbelievable. Well. Rip in peace, Anna Henrietta and Sylvia Anna. <sighs> well, that sucks. Another two weeks later, man, this place looks gloomy. As <laughs> wow. Need some flowers, a wreath, or I've none. Sold everything. I was just on my way out. No sense hanging about with nothing to do. Should come as no shock, sir. Had the funeral. Folk took it all. Men, women, children, all wished to lay a bouquet on the Duchess's grave. Wind flowers, peonies, gladioli. But she liked common roses best. I know. Her ladies-in-waiting would come here at times. I'd choose the loveliest blooms for her. Fragrant, big petals, the kind that last a long time. Ah, uh, I've still not come to terms with it. To be killed by her own sister. How could it happen? She was too trusting. Anna Henrietta wanted to believe there was still hope for Siana, that she'd show remorse. She reached a hand out to her. Too soon. Now, was there any way I could have saved that? I don't think so. I know you. You're that witcher from the north. The one that saved us from the beast. Mm-hmm. Could say that. Wait here. Take these. Thought you were out of flowers. I put a bouquet aside. I was to take it to her myself. But you have it. I know you held the Duchess dear. How much do I owe you? Not a copper. Keep your coin and raise a toast in her memory tonight. Do just that. Farewell. Well, that was sad. Oh, look at that. That's pretty cool. Oh, man. 
again. This is sad. A monument to Anna Henrietta. This is It's all sad and gloomy here. So sad and gloomy. Down Witcher, I was certain you'd departed. Couldn't. Anna Henrietta was wondrous, beautiful, good, the best ruler one could hope to have. Yet I let her down. Don't be so hard on yourself. No one expected Siana to do that, persist to the end. And none of us did anything to stop her. Because there was nothing we could do. Uh, I suppose you are right. But when someone so beloved dies, one cannot help but search one's soul for blame. And even the hardiest knights grow faint-hearted then. Come to pay my respects. Bid the Duchess farewell. White roses. They were her favorite. Go inside then. She lies in the ducal crypt. In one room with her murderer. Despite my protests. Oh what? man. Who decided that? The Regent's Council. A pack of old men who've statutes and codices for hearts. Ducal blood flowed in Siana's veins. And she was never legally disinherited. So they ruled she should lie alongside Anna Rieta. Poor Anna Rieta having to lie next to Sylviana. My goodness. Hmm. I do it for both. She may have been terrible, but no one should have to die. Death is a terrible thing. And all this, what did it bring you? Rest in peace. Rest in peace, Anrietta. I it ended this way, that I failed to prevent it. Hope you can forgive me. Rest in peace. Ah, <gasps> Regis. Stylish crypt, quite subdued. Yes, this is the kind of eternal resting place I dream of. Moments like this, I never know if you're joking or serious. Serious, Geralt, serious. It's remarkably peaceful, subtly charming to the hilt. A perfect match for the Duchess's dignity. Ah, you humans, you never cease to amaze me. To feel despair in the face of natural processes to which you are predestined. I've come to take you from this place, my friend. Dare say you deserve a speck of respite after the mad whirl of the last few days. I thought this was two weeks later. Unless there's other stuff that happened in the last two days. All those deaths I failed to prevent. I feel pretty awful right about now. Can't help thinking I could have done more. Now two sons. So do all say. Or more accurately, chaos rules here. Hand in hand with despair. Duchess won over people's hearts. All Beauclair now weeps for her. A mass outburst of emotion. Well, it seems her subjects have adopted some of their recent ruler's traits. 
Why the sarcasm? Thought you liked Donna Henrietta. I did. And I do truly rue her passing. Me too. Then let us drink. Whatever you say about Siona, you gotta admit, she was unbending. That she was. I do admit it. Though, in her case, it would have been better if she had been a tad more... Mm, philosophical. Pausing from time to time to reflect on the propriety of her actions. Wait True. a second. What if she didn't get that red ribbon? Would she have died to Detlaf? How do you find that? Oh, person? interesting. Not too strong. Just right. Credit the local mandrake of the Alrauna Diavolus variety for that. The tubers which grow in this area's volcanic soil have an altogether unique flavor profile and display a remarkably uncommon dark brown tint. Fascinating. All I can say is this batch turned out excellent. Indeed. It might be wise to stockpile some roots for the future. Would you care to accompany me? If you think let's it's a good go. idea, let's go. But I think you might be forgetting one thing. Fresh mandrake root of this variety is highly toxic, even to a witcher. Ah, not a problem. I never forget matters of safety and hygiene in alchemy. Here, gloves and a mask. Don them, and you shall be in no danger. Thanks. Right then, let's go. This <laughs> ah, where do I get the gloves and mask? How do I put on the gloves and mask? I don't see them anywhere. Oh, I guess they're here. Yes, gloves. Oh, so dreamy. Penny for your thoughts. Let me let's guess. go find some of those mandrake so roots. Dreamy. No, I was thinking. What, what? What was he thinking? Ah, Mandrake. Ah. Now, where'd that bloodsucker go? Won't be easy to track down. He's a. Where did he go? Empire, after all. Regis! Where did Regis go? What in the world? Damn it, where'd you go? Where's he running off to? Regis. Oh goodness. Oh goodness. Stupid. I did what I had to do. Oh goodness. Vampires are going against them now. Oh, good granny. Those Bruxae, eh? they called you a traitor. Alas, we have a very simple code of honor, we vampires. So simple you might call it trivial. Either one is with us, unconditionally, regardless of the circumstances, or... Won't let it go, will they? They will not. Fortunately, we have another rule, an unwritten one, and just as trivial as the first. It is neatly summarized in the saying, out of sight, out of mind. That is why I must leave Toussaint for a vastly long time, most like. No, yeah, not you, Regis. Oh, let us make for my camp. I have an overwhelming desire to have another drink. Mmm, supreme bouquet. Firm, defined beginning. Then develops gently, rising to a, a startling finish. Don't you think? Not much of a connoisseur. Then it is high time you started your education. After all, the Corvo Bianco vineyard is now yours. By the way, I left a gift for you in your new home. What? A gift? The nightstand. I'll take it. <laughs> Thanks. Mind telling me what it is? A trifle. 
that will nonetheless be useful should you need mutagens. Incidentally, have you thought about what you'll do with your prize? Shall you hang your swords over the mantle and take to pruning vines? <laughs> know what? Think I just might. Come on now, don't laugh. Maybe not today or tomorrow. But one day I'll want to see what it's like to just wake up every day in my own bed. Oh, stop, please. Sounds so sentimental, my fangs have begun to hurt. Then what? Will you begin writing your memoirs like Dandelion? <laughs> I can remember a night, not too far from here if I'm not mistaken. We hid in a cave while a blizzard raged all about. Does that sound at all familiar? How could it not? We just set off to rescue Ciri from Vilgefortz. Oh, our encounter with Vilgefortz. That is something I do not remember so fondly. But that first stay in Beauclair, far calmer than this one. Seemed like a land straight out of a fairy tale back then. Its sole problem, cellars too small to accommodate all that wine. Appearances, Geralt. Appearances, like Mamoons and Dopplers, deceive. So what did become of Vilgefortz? Killed Hang him. on. <laughs> I was going to say, I didn't get that far in the book yet. Don't spoil it, Geralt. <sighs> I so don't feel like going anywhere. Yay! While longer. What a fantastic so we DLC. Watch. We have witnessed, and in fact on several occasions incited, many great and weighty events. After all that toil, I believe we deserve a bit of a rest. You deserve a rest, Geralt. You deserve that a rest. You. Oh! Why are you looking at the camera, Geralt? <laughs> Oh, absolutely incredible. Man, what a great DLC. That was quite spectacular. <sighs> it's quite spectacular indeed. Actually, I'd love to go home. Be it ever so humble. Wait a second, I mean, let's go home. Let's go, wait, how do I get to my, that was fantastic. Oh, what a great... Please tell me, yeah, I was gonna say, please tell me that, uh, that going home means going to my vineyard because that was fantastic. That DLC was just great. The new map, like, new area was fantastic. Oh, so much to do. Kept me interested the entire time. Each side quest was awesome and interesting, and be it ever so humble, let us arrive back home to my humble abode that is... Manabes Basil. Some unknown individual barged into the residence. No, it was just Regis. But to no avail. Who is it? Alas, they did not do Wait. the basic cutters. Oh, no, I guess there's someone new in there. Who could it be? Hello? Hello? Anyone here? Was that someone's traveling supplies? A dandelion! Oh my goodness. Dandelion? What the hell are you doing here? <laughs> I'm a figment of your imagination, because you really want me to be here. Brought you a housewarming gift. It's also an illusion. How do you like it? Oh my goodness. Mine's better. It's good. Make sure good to see. Dignified and manlier than in real life. Does it? The painter's a friend of mine. Could be she gave me slightly broader shoulders? Well, I'm sure. Don't doubt it. But didn't I see this painting at your place? This is its perfect replica, and it's yours. To remember me by. Good. So, some important business. If anyone asks, I'm not here. Last time I was in Toussaint, enjoying myself, admittedly, Honorietta. Dandelion, 
That is, the Duchess. Dandelion. Got a bit carried away and banished me on pain of death. I wouldn't want... Dandelion. Anna Henrietta. She's dead. What? But... How? Mm, come on. Got a story to tell you for a change. Sadly, I couldn't stop Sienna. She killed her own sister. Just one small consolation. Sienna's dead too. Is Man. that so? Gods. What a terrible, terrible loss. She was the morning sun striking dew. Vibrant butterfly among dun moths. Should have ridden down here with you. Might have done something together to avert this. But... I had my hands full back home. How are you, old friend? Not well, unfortunately. After you left Novigrad, this one day, Priscilla was attacked. In the what? street. Again? She was wounded badly. Took a long time to recover. Oh. Luckily, she's better now. I thought what I was there for that. About? Who the hell attacked her? Still looking for the bastard who hurt her. Once I find him, he'll regret what... Okay. Sorry, Dandelion. You've got your own problems, your own priorities. Can't expect you to be at my side whenever anything goes... Oh, I think... Okay, so this isn't my playthrough, because I definitely saved her in my... Or found her and did everything I can to figure it out, so... Unless it happens again. How's business? You and Zoltan still have your tavern? Or you know him. We'll share a jug of mead and he'll go on about some new plan he's got. Nothing... Recently, we discovered Novograd's largest wine importer watering down his wines, but so clever, you'd never... So how did hmm. you figure out he was up to... This one day I was feeling down in the muck. Decided to lift my spirits by... Well, so I knocked back a bottle. Nothing. Then enough... Might not be a lightweight anymore. Could be those years of... <laughs> it took me five bottles to start seeing double. I thought, huh, might just be a weird day. So I tried this... I told Zoltan. He tried it and confirmed my findings. So we decided to ask the I threatened to tell everyone about his trickery unless he gave me a discount. Ah, blackmailing him. Okay, whatever. See you later, Dan. Say talking to you, Dan Lion. Oh, he's gonna sit there and play his loot. Maybe we'll soft first touches. Let me just go quick see what Detlaf I mean Tetlaf, why do I keep calling him that? Letter from Regis. Um, ba 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 ba. My mutinger. Of course, you did many of this instrument. However, you like perhaps something more fitting. Um, let's finish some convinces. Convinced. Uh, ba ba. Uh, oh, okay. Mutinigator. Gen generator. Oh no, no! I didn't want to lay down. Shoot. Goodness. Oh, look at that. Oh, you're getting bonuses. Oh, that's actually interesting. Very nice. I forgot because uh, I did remember seeing that at some point. Okay, so what does this mutagenerator do? Mutagenerator. Man, I can't even talk. Device for creating mutagens. Oh, that's pretty cool. Sweet. Okay. Well, guys, thank you so much for watching the Witcher 3 Blood and Wine DLC. And this is, you know, pretty much the last Witcher thing to happen. So, because they're done with Witcher 3, this is the last DLC. So, thank you so much for watching. If sometime in the near future, or the later future, I decide to do a new game plus again. I feel like I said, I'm playing one of my free time. Uh, but come back to it and then we'll see but for now. Thank you so much. It's been an awesome series I had a blast with Witcher 3 had a blast with uh, Hearts of Stone and an absolute amazing time blast as it were playing good old-fashioned blood and wine, so I will see you guys later Thanks for watching and meow Meow